guys and welcome back to episode 2 of Tank Mechanic Simulator with only 5 days left till release. I'm going to be trying to put out one video every day and I have absolutely loved the reception I've been getting on this um, on this so far. So thank you so much guys for engaging with me and enjoying the series. So we're going to be uh, clicking I believe start and getting back into the game. So last episode as you know we, uh, we pulled out a Storm Gerbeer tree. Um, which Thomas thank, uh, thankfully corrected me on its correct name um, and I will be doing a stream probably Monday after I've done my coursework on you know dismantling the whole thing bringing it up to standard and I hope you guys will enjoy that so don't forget to come over and check out my Twitch Monday uh, it'll be roughly around 6 7 o'clock GMT when I do that but I will see you guys once we just load into the game. So here we are, we're back in our brilliant workshop. And we haven't got a tank here, so let's come over here and find ourselves a tank. So we've got shopping time. I have another tank, and it's a T-34-76. Right, let's accept the offer and find out what is wrong with this. So let's have a little look. Yeah, we'll come on to that. Ah, oh, she's a piece of beautiful Russian engineering. Look at this. It is great. So what we need to do is we need to come over here. Come over to tank analysis. And let's see what we're missing. So we're missing a gearbox cover, engine cover. Yep, yep, yep. Fuel tanks. A transmission cover hatch. And there we go. We'll buy the missing parts, which will cost us 3150 and we now need to go into assembly mode so what do I need to do so I swear there's more than this that I need to do is there because I swear let's get you in you in you in box cover ah okay so we need to get a fuel tank yeah that's quite scary to think that sitting in this tank your fuel is right here I just feel so I just feel so exposed sitting like that, sitting like that and get these exhausts on transmission cover hatch and exhaust pipes and there we go, we'll send that one back to the owner, so real quick, let me just get a beautiful screenshot of this, um, let, how do I get rid of this stuff again, right there we go, and let's get a screenshot, there we go, that looks absolutely beautiful, come over here, go to organizer, and finish, so we are going to get 4,000 for that hopefully, check the new emails, Find an extract tank. So, okay, let's uh, let's accept that one, and we're going to go out and find a new tank. So, I will be back, guys, once we actually get into the area. So, this is where we are, and we'll we, oh, we've got a little Willy's Jeep over here, and we're going to check where the extraction site is. So, the extraction site is up here to the north so we need to go straight across and up and we'll find it there so straight across and up so let's get into our vehicle and we'll turn the engine on and lights and we'll get going i love this little jeep this little jeep we're gonna name it henry henry the jeep <coughs> use metal de detector magnometer or drone if they are unlocked and mark the place by putting a marker she's not the fastest little vehicle but by god she is a beautiful little vehicle let's turn her, turn her around here and stop around here right we're gonna get out and we're gonna need this fella so can I see a tank turret popping up anywhere no, I can't. 
So I got to now walk around this whole area now to find. Oh, what's that over there? Oh, that was nothing. I was just being an idiot. So I wonder where this fella's going to be. This may take me a while, guys. Oh. No, I didn't get a spike. Tell you what, guys, I will be back once I've found out where the hell our little fella is. So, guys, we just found something over here. So we're going to just make sure that... Right, around this one here. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here. And we're going to see if we can dig some of it out. I just love that. And let's get this shovel and run over here. So that was, it took me probably about five minutes to find it. I went all the way around the edge and everything like that. So let's start digging. I had a very strong signal here. Right, come on. Oh, oh, there's the top of it. And what are we looking at here? So, right. What type of tank will this be? We're going to need to dig some more of it out to find out, I bet. But I don't like the fact that I can't see anything. Is there a flashlight, a torch, maybe? No. There is no torch. So, if the devs are watching, please add torch. We really need a torch. Hmm. What's this so far? So, I, I can normally tell by the body of it. Oh, one minute. So, it's got two. So, this clearly looks American. Americano, Americano. Well, I think it looks American anyway, but I'm going to need to see a little bit more. This might be an M22 Locust, maybe. Is this an M22 Locust? I'm going to say M22 Locust, and I'll be... And I'm going to quickly go and get the uh, excavation team out. I have one email, apparently. Ugh. These people, they're so needy. Always emailing me. Please, sir, uh, fix up my tank. Right. We found something. Well, that's good. <coughs> right. So we got to clean this fella off. But first. I think this... Oh, wait, no. This is a Sherman. I don't know why, but it looked like a locust from the top. So we're going to dig you out. And let's start spraying you down. Let's start getting you wet, darling. Oh, I know you like being wet for me. Oh, yes. You're totally wet, darling. I've never seen somebody so wet for me in my life. Oh, yeah. You get wet, baby. You get wet. Oh, clean that engine off. Just spray water into that engine because that definitely won't... Actually, then again, how much more damage can be caused? It's been underground for ages. What's that show that everyone uh, that I used to watch when I was younger? Time Team. Does anybody remember watching Time Team if you're in Britain? Um, that, you know, with, um, what's his name? Robinson. T Tony Robinson? No, I, I forget his name anyway. He used to be Baldrick um, on the um, Blackadder series. And the amount of stuff they bring up, bring out like a bit of pottery from like the Roman era. And it would just be there like, well, this could potentially have been the toilet. Just like, ah, great. So you're handling a ancient shitter. It, it used to be, it used to be one of my favourite shows, actually. Where did I get this from? Oh, it's over here. So I need to go put this on the trailer now. I'm going to get a quick picture of that. That looks pretty cool. There we go. Let's get you onto the trailer. Where is Mr. Trailer? It's over there, I've got to go take a screenshot of it on the trailer again, That's, that stuff was so cool. Look at that, that looks pretty sick, like you got the uh, the crane to lift it up, the excavator, the fuel truck, and then you just got this 
thing sitting on the back here. It's like, oh, beautiful. I think that is a beautiful touch myself. So really good to play with on that one. And let's go back to let's go back to workshop. Yep, that would be that cost us a thousand, a thousand to dig that out. That doesn't really bother me. So Monday, instead of having one tank to um to fully work on, we now have two, and we're going to see if we can find another email maybe with something to do, like um maybe maybe somebody has just you know a random tiger tank sitting in their back garden and like hey would you fix up my tiger tank and be like where did you find this tiger tank under a bush? It's a tank. Yeah, it's under a bush. Like great. And that actually reminds me because if you look at like the British Museum, you know, they have wonders from across the world, right? They're technically all stolen. Cause you cause just imagine the police report on that. Yes, um so where did you get this pyramid? It It was under a bush. Just how is that how was it under a bush? It was just under a bush in Norfolk. And um, what about these Easter Island heads, famous for only ever being in the Easter Island? Yeah, actually, that was quite a hard find. We found that up in, in the Yorkshire Dales, actually. Just like, really? So anyway, we're going to we're gonna quickly go put this outside. Yep, let's just move you. Move tank to um, to the yard. Let's go put you in, in yard slot two. And see what else we have available. <coughs> Check the new emails. D. Rustin, your uncle Tom has recommended you to us. Um, D. Rustin with turret and exterior hall. Let's do it, boys. We just need to do a bit of D. Rustin. Right. But before we do that, what we're going to do is we're going to have a little look over here now. So, um, so we're going to upgrade for that. Okay. That's definitely needed. And this is. What's this? Uh, merge two tools in one, cutting off elements with rusted bolts and grinding with rusted off elements. That looks so cool. What's this? Um, don't sh not sure if that's needed. That's needed. And that's definitely needed. I've been sitting there so often and it's just been like... Ugh. So what's this? Okay, maybe having a museum would be cool. And a crafting table, maybe? What's the rest of it? What's this? Okay. So where's this um, workshop then? Oh, Jesus. Hello. This looks well cool. Okay, so... Oh, so I can only get it for the tanks that are actually in here. Oh, okay. And that's still upgrade. This looks so cool. Oh, I want this workshop in my house. Someone come put this in. So, right, I need to click on the... Right. Let's start grinding away, boys. So all that rust is gone. Ah. Oh. Rust away, boys. Rust away. Bang! And the rust is gone. Right. Rust removal. I love how what he's done is he's done he's done down there great. You know, like the tyres all fixed and it looks brilliant. But has he done the rest of the tank? No. He just got lazy halfway through. He's like, nah, lad, I ain't doing it. That can't be asked really, to be fair with you. It's like, great, so I've got to do it? Yep. It's like, you you are a bag of shit, really. You, you're just a massive bag of shit. You're making me do this. You could have done this yourself. But no, you're too lazy, weren't you, Tom? You're just too lazy. That's why I'm quoting you, Thomas Murphy. You're lazy. You never decided to do this. Left me to do it. Bastard. Right, how are we almost done with this rush job? Right. Let's see. You are still rusty, and you are rather rusty. Right. That looks like all of that's done. Oh, we'll get this bit done. 
Uh, yep, yep, and yep. That seems to be all done now. Right. Oh, I've never done you. Right, hang on. Oh, right. We'll get these bits first. And you. I love how it naturally starts going back to its old green self. But I would so love this job. Who else out there would like this job as well, you know, like getting these tanks in and repairing them and bringing them back to their natural prowess? Because this would just be so cool in my eyes, just, just like working on one of these. Ah, oh, it'd be so fun. Remind me to put that on my resume, would work as fixing tanks. Be so cool to do. Yep. And let's get all the rest off here. So, I need to... Are we almost done on this? This is kind of... I have to admit, this is kind of dull to do, but... Oh, well. Right, can I reach you? Yep. Turn you back to normal. And one more bit, I believe. Alright, I'm on 90% rust removal. What else have we got to do here? Repair parts. Well, you need repairing. Uh, is there any more slots? Ah, well. This might help. Ah, shit. I just fell underneath. God damn it. God damn it, Jerry. This is all your fault. Oh, come on, this is, this is fun. Who else agree? Oh, Jesus Christ. Anything underneath there? Well, surely that's got to be done. So, what, so it needed de rusting done here. Are you not green? You look green. Right, you. I'm on 94%, what else is there to de-rust? Right. There we go. We'll soon find out what needs de-rusting. By this method, we will actually figure out what we need to do. Though we'll probably get in a little bit of trouble for doing this. So I never asked you to do that. Well, tough shit, mate. I done it. You'll live with it. Get you done. Right. That actually looks pretty cool. The silver tank looks better than the rest of the bloody tanks. Oh. Oh, wait, no. I already did you. And what haven't I done? Surely I've done everything then. Right, now I need to do that block there. Right, let's get you shaved in. Where do I feel I'm going to get in shit for doing this? Right. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I will admit, I want better steps to do. Come on. Why won't you let me up? There we go. Right, get you done. You should be done by now. There we go. And across here. Right, you. So it tells me what I haven't done at least. So that shaft is done there. Yep, I made a funny joke. So that little bit in there. Right. You. So there's literally like two things I've missed. Yeah, two things I've missed. Right, come here, bum boy. I 
I don't know why you're not removing this rust. Right. You are coming off. We'll get... We'll replace you with something else. Maybe... Maybe we can use our workshop. And this one in here. That should surely be it. Oh god no. Storage. Um, this is a Sherman. Sherman, Sherman, Sherman. And there we go. Outsource repairs. Just to climb up. Thank you. Well, where else is there rust? Are we talking the inside part? I mean, do we have to do in there? What What are we talking about here, boys? Come on. What I do is I wait for this thing to be um, repaired and see if it comes back. Because, can, can I just, if I drop that there, can I open the... Does it include the inside here? <coughs> I don't know why my voice decided to break that. I'd do in here as well, see if that's what he wants me to do. And now I'm stuck. Please let me out. Thank you. I did not agree to this. Where's my rust? Reset tools. Uh, right. So let's get our rust tool. That's not the rust tool. This is the rust tool. And up. And up. And up. And up. And two. And up. And two. And up. And up. And up. And two. Right. Enjoy. Enjoy. I think I had to do in here as well. Yeah, there we go. We get the floor done. Oh, don't forget the cup holder. Every respectable tank has a cup holder. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Ah, let me out. Did not consent to this. Uh, right, Sherman. Sherman, okay. Guess you don't want to work today. And let us see. We now need to go to assembly mode. And wooden shelf looking beautiful there is no more rust how can there be more rust nah this is bollocks I call bollocks there's no more rust in there oh, Jesus right there we go right now we can actually do it organizer finish order so we're gonna get at least 10 grand Oh, beautiful. Check the emails. And there we go, guys. I'm going to end it here. We have done two tanks today, and I have two tanks sitting out here in the yard. Actually, real quick, I'm going to show you the yard. If you guys haven't already seen the yard, the yard will be here. Right, and I'm back. So this is the yard. So we have our Sturm um tree. And um, we have our M4A3 E8 Sherman. I'm not sure if this is a Firefly variant. It could be a Firefly variant. I'm not sure. But these two tanks, this is the yard. You can literally use that to pick up trash. Like, yes. Thank you. I, I enjoy picking up the trash from down here. We can use it to get some um, working parts. Oh, what's this? We just have random tanks sitting here. Why can't I work on these beauties? Maybe this... I think 
think that's a KV, a KV2. And this one over here, let me see. This one is an M10 um, Wolverine for definite. Oh, I just saw something there. Oh, oh yay. That that was great. But yes, guys, this these are some old Land Rovers. But this is the warehouse, guys, where the yard. So I think we get to clean this up over time. I'm not sure, but. Oh wait, this is the museum. Real quick, I'm so sorry. I keep procrastinating. I'm meant to be ending the video. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm not doing a good job here. So, this is the museum. I think it looks pretty good. Let's just put that one on there for now. Ah, oh, that looks pretty nice. I like that. But anyway, I'm going to end it here, guys. If you did enjoy today's video, please do like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget, share this one to your friends who also love tanks. Um, in the future, hopefully I will be doing a giveaway. If I can work out a, um, a, a game key off of developers, then I'll be doing a giveaway. But thank you so much for enjoying today's video. See you next time. Goodbye.